Hello artists. This week in art we are going to start our winter painting project and I'm so excited that we get to paint together from home. So last week we talked about value and you made a value scale and this week we're going to do kind of the same thing but using paint. So we'll be making our value scale which will become our winter sky and we'll use paints to do that. So you'll need a paintbrush, your heavy painting paper, and the white and blue paints that went home with the last supply pickup. Um, also, it's good to have a paper towel and a piece of cardboard or something else that can work as um, a palette to mix your paint on. All right, so we are creating a winter sky and we're gonna be starting with our lightest value, which is white. So we're gonna create kind of a, a circle spot in the center of our page with the white paint. We're gonna paint it white even though we're on white paper. And this is going to become the light coming from the moon in our night winter sky. If you wanted to draw circles lightly with a pencil to show you where each of your values will go, you could do that. I'm just gonna kinda wing it. Okay, so I have my lightest shade and now I'm going to tint my paint by adding color with white. That's called tinting. So you don't wanna mix in your paint cup. So find some surface that will work well to mix on. And for your first value, you want it to be pretty light. This is just our next shade from our white that we've added on the paper. So that's looking pretty good. I'm gonna go ahead and add it to my paper. And then I'm just gonna keep moving out from this center. And I'll do the same thing now but I want to make it a little bit darker. You gotta be careful with the blue paint. It can get pretty dark really fast. So it's just a little bit goes a long way. And you can always add more too. So I would start with a tiny bit of blue and keep adding until you get the shade that you want. This is washable paint, but you might want to lay down some paper to work on. All right, so I'm ready to create my next shade. And I want to get that a little bit darker than this one. All right, that's looking pretty good. wants to move around. All right, so you can see how my value scale is starting to come together from lightest to darkest. Now I'm getting pretty dark here. And as you get to the outer circles, you need to mix a little more paint because you're covering more space. Try and keep that white in your cup nice and clean because we'll use it next week and we'll add uh, some snowy hills and snow in our sky. I think I have room for maybe two more tints, two more values in this scale. So I'm gonna start getting pretty dark here. And now as you're getting darker, you'll, you'll start using more blue and less white. 
whereas when we started creating those real light shades, it was the other way around. This one looks really similar, so I'm gonna add even more blue. I think it needs to be a little darker. 